This session covers logging into OPAS. After you double-click your desktop icon, this is the screen you'll be looking at. Your organization will have set up your OPAS names and passwords, so just enter the name there and the password there. For North American clients, the language is already preset, so we don't have to do anything with that. This Save Password checkbox only has an effect if your installation is specifically set up to remember passwords. With many organizations, Save Passwords goes against security policy, so the default is to have that box unchecked. If, however, your system is set up to remember passwords, then your login screen will look exactly like this one, and all you have to do is click the green OK. As OPAS launches, you see it going through those progress bars. That's the software preloading all the data functions and reports it will need so that when the program operates, all that time is saved when moving between program areas. When that's finished, OPAS will launch and load your personal startup screen. In this example, the startup screen is the calendar. You can have any startup screen you want, and in fact, the software will allow you to preload five different program areas for five different startup screens on different tabs. Setting that is covered in another video. After you're done using the software, just click the exit button in the lower right-hand corner, and you're set.